I'll be. I'm red. You're, You're red. red. I'm blue. Oh. Somebody else is gonna have to start rolling the die other than the other. It's not that. even my die. <laughs> it doesn't matter. It was meant to be. It was so funny. I was playing in a <laughs> store showdown, and um, and I had been rolling this all day, right? Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, as I rolled it and. The, a guy that I had played is like, well, I, it kind of looks worn. Yeah, that's what it's supposed to. Yeah. Uh, and he's like, well, the sides are a little different or whatever. I was like, all right, sure, no problem. What do you want to do? He pulls out two of his dice and rolls them. I was like, <laughs> okay, never mind. I ain't going to say anything. Let's, let's just move on. However you want to do this. All right, let me show my hand. Go ahead. All right, so here's what we got. I uh, don't need two copies of that. And that's for a little later in the game. So I think we're going we're gonna to roll with these. See how it goes. Who, who are you playing? You're playing Grand Inquisitor? Grand Inquisitor. In yellow? Mm-hmm. <clears throat> All right, so the Han, a really bad printed Han, so that's completely... Hey, man. On a... Uh, My home printer is offended. On a Lockheed, Lockheed Martin uh, budget. Don't, don't, bring, don't bring Lockheed Martin in. Uh, <laughs> the uh, mine are like... Really nice. Steven loves them because it, it's a school district page for, for them to be printed. So, mm. all right, let's see. I did not build. Oh my gosh, I have to definitely shuffle this since I'm going to get <laughs> three of those in my opening hand. <laughs> they might might come to help, but I don't think I need three of them. So if I play this deck a little different, one, it's it's Tyler. So I I have not seen this yet. Oh yeah, yeah. I made this jank so, up last night. So that's that's one, two. Make sure I got, we have to make sure people understand this. This is one of those things that a lot of people, as they watch these videos that are being done and everything else like that, we hang around each other all the time. I've known this dude for over twenty years now. So the things that we say are different than what you're going to hear, tones and all that kind of stuff. And so that being said. Um, when uh, we make fun of Justin, we get to make fun of Justin, not you guys. So y'all shut up and leave Justin alone. We get to pick on him all we want. This is garbage, Tyler. I'm um, really sorry. And so, um, but because I'm mulliganed, I gotta keep this. Um, I think. Oof. Oh, this is gonna be crazy. Um, all right, here we go. All right. So, I uh, got a real big play here. Greedo. Yeah. I like Greedo. I do like Greedo. I like Greedo. So, Greedo can have a guild target. All right. So, if Greedo dies, yeah, he gets three damage on my base. Yeah, three damage for being unique. So, that includes uh, McClunky, doesn't it? No, if I'm McClunky and back to hand, he's not defeated or captured. Uh -huh. So the bounty would just fall off. That's a great clarification for those kids out there. All right, here you go. Initiative. Okay. Um, okay. I do like the new Han. He is pretty good. He is pretty good. Uh, He's going to keep the the cost of red three and K two and a lot of those cards where they are. Uh, Greedo is going to do three to your base. Um, let's see. No, there's a there's a few cards in there. I was really excited to play at one less. Drop Punishing Worm for three. Use Grand Inquisitor. Ready it. Ready it, and then it's going to kill right three. Okay. <clears throat> and pass. Go ahead and 
do that. Okay, and you get three damage to my base. Mm -hmm. I'm going to play Toro Calican, who I have no memory of who this dude is from the Mandalorian, but apparently he's the most powerful bounty hunter in the galaxy. I mean, he's he's exa almost exactly like the legendary Boba Fett. Am I right? It's, I mean, just about as good, yeah. That's what's crazy. That is what's crazy. Um... I guess Tyler hates it, or Justin hates it when I do that. I better quit. I think someone else said that too, by the way. Someone else said, hey, don't do not do that to your, don't flip the cards. It's one less, right? Okay. K2SO, okay. Uh, can you use Grand Inquisitor? Stand them up. So that guy was in, um, the Mandalorian episode. Oh, you get that? I know. Uh, that basically allowed you, allowed him, it was when he was uh, hunting down, why did you gotta make my calls out? Um, the, uh, that he, he was looking for, sh sh uh, what is her name? Shannon Finn or whatever her name is? Yeah, yeah. He's the dude who shows up and caps her. <clears throat> um, what am I putting down? This is really interesting. This is you got you got you got you got me, kid. This is crazy. Um, yeah, let's put that down. <coughs> I could have done that. Let's see. Hold on. Oh, I guess I could do that. All right. All right. This is crazy. You got clan challengers for five. All right. They get raid three. Raid three. Give him a, another one of those guild. Was it target? Guild target. That's all right. <laughs> all right. Mm. Stand him up. Stand him pass. Are you scared to stand him up? Hmm. Let's see. How do I want to do this? So if I do that, four into him, no overwhelm. Kills me though. How many cards in your hand? Four? Three? Three? Hmm. So let's do this. Let's have a little fun. Let's play Carabas and hit him for three. Mm -hmm. Now see what you do. Ah. Mm. Uh. Now I think I have no reason not to stand him up. So I'll kill him mm -hmm. and do three to base. Two and six to base. No, actually, no, doing, no, just five. No, you're doing nine to base. It's three from K2's ability. Three. F no, it's only two, two from guild target, mm -hmm. and then three for his overwhelm. Yes, yes. So a total of eight. I was going to get there, but you were going too fast. Kind of surprised you did that, but okay. <coughs> When does he come out again? He's six. Six. So I'm taking an initiative. All right. So I'll play him. And I'll play that. He is not a rebel. You can't do that. I can still play it, Tyler. You can still play it. Jeez, you're killing me, Smalls. All I didn't right. want to use it on K2. And then I'll hit you for three more. You I mean, K2 would have gotten the damage out from Overwhelm. That's true. Oh, man. Man, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. Four, five, six... Killing wing leader is worth it. So let's do that and two to your base. Mm, three. Three to yours. Just one card in hand? Mm hmm. Um, I'm trying to do this. <laughs> it's I, I can't do it with less tokens. <laughs> uh, all right, Grand Inquisitor comes out. Flash 
And he's he he also stands people up. Oh no, unit three or less three or less power. Yeah, Ruthless so Raider. Ruthless Raider doesn't fit anymore. You have all your resources. You use them all. Yep, I use them all. Three base. Really, you didn't play anything, huh? No. Uh, that, yeah, we'll we'll talk about this. We'll talk about this later. One, two. Going to seven. Yeah, this is this is interesting, Tyler. Um, three to base. Three to base. Let's go away. Forty or base. Forty or base. <laughs> you just still got to put one back in. Oh, here we go. Oh, that's what I meant to do. Yeah, that's what I meant to do. That's what I meant to do. All right. Still on my room in the ground right here. Ouch. Hurt my feelings when you say that. I, I did damage to you. Uh, oh, didn't I do damage to you? Oh, no, you just attacked me. Yeah. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see how this does. Alright. Good job. Santon. He does not get to ready, unfortunately. Yet. Right? Yeah, when he gets damaged, he can start doing stuff. Hurting for other ships to put in. It's not a bad ship. Not a bad ship at all. Yeah, I don't know that it fits with him, but. Uh, uh, oh, surprise attack. Mm -hmm. Hit your base for six. Stand up, Chris. Space for three and does one to Han. So you got a 21. All right. Yeah, I mean, this is. No, this is not going to make it. Especially a 25 point base. So. Um, yeah, I mean, like I said, because my draws were like, I, I were getting these. Uh, that's those were my draws I was getting. I think my opening hand was something like it was it was really 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 tough. Uh, well, here let's swap. Yeah. Well, I mean it's it's not that it's swap. I don't mind playing this again. Mm -hmm. But what I want and I'm going to play it again. But what I'm saying is I don't know. If, we'll see what else is in the deck to see if we can curve it out a little bit. Um, I mean, the goal yeah. the goal is to be lane dodging, right? So you, you go heavy in space, and then on the ground, you bombing run and uh, rancor. Yeah, I saw the rancor in there. So that's what you were saying. You want to go heavy in space. Mm -hmm. okay. yeah, heavy in space, light on the ground, and then you've got lots of area damage stuff on the ground. Initiative goes to you. All right, we'll try that. We'll try that. That's one thing about a lot of these decks is giving people ideas. And some people might see something, hey, this card is better than that card um, in here. So that's why you have those guys in here, I guess, the fickle mercenaries. I mean, they're good, though. It's Paying for them is tough. Well, it's four, right? Isn't that yeah. what it is? So. Mm -hmm. And your opponent could always just pay to get him right back. So that's for cost stuff. It's tough. Um, let's see. 
Interesting, though. Um, um, yeah, I probably need to stick with this. Hmm. Let me know when you're ready. Well, you know, kind of like when you watch the TV show Survivor, everybody tells you don't trust that person, you know, because they've seen the episodes... The internet's probably telling me right now to put this card down, this card down. But I'm kind of curious what to do. I'm thinking these two would go down. That would could work, which means let's go. Let's go with this. Let's just let's try some. Well, Especially after what he just told me. Um, let's go with this then. Alright. Okay. Alright, so here's my six. I think my resourcing decisions are pretty simple here. We got a smuggle card and a duplicate unique. So we'll resource those and go. So Jason was saying that he's not he doesn't know what about the smuggle cards. I think they're valuable. And oh we, yeah, they have a place. Some of them are better than others. Yeah, for sure. Well, I think I think uh, the um, I think the the um, this blasters definitely are good. Mm -hmm. okay. mm Be tough. Oh. All right, you first. Two to base. Two to base. Two to base. Oh, I guess you Three get, to your base. You hit in the face by these these guys. I mean, that's always a really... I mean, I think this... I mean, he's going to really help him skyrocket in value uh, through TCG. Drop. Fifth brother. Okay, Grand Inquisitor is going to stand up, fifth brother. Uh, then fifth brother will attack your base, do himself one damage and one decay to it, so, so he does uh, five damage. Because it... He gets raid one for each damage, yes. Oh, okay, because you, you did that as well. So, mm -hmm. uh, five to base. Mm -hmm. <coughs> and I'll pass. Hmm. Or something here. Just a reminder, fifth brother can one shot K2. That's okay. Okay. So you get, yep. Evazon is dead. You can get all your resources back. Uh, you can also hit me for five. My base. I can hit your base for five. I mean, putting me at 13 on a 25 point base. Well, and he doesn't have a health left actually to ping, though, I think about it. Uh, so I think fifth brother will just do five to your base. Uh, so he will hit you for three to base and another three. Mm -hmm. Gonna play Django Fett. <clears throat> So 
The Grand Inquisitor, Stand Up Django. <coughs> What's it he got? Not dead though. Hey Justin, he just used an aggression to kill uh, Evazon. Mm-hmm. Three. Three of yours. looking for a way to do it with less tokens, but there is no way to do it. Do a seven. Uh, put rich reward on red three. So it's a bounty. When it dies, I can give an experience token to up to two units. Oh, there it is. All these guys are dead. Uh, Greedo is going to do his thing, and I'll top deck you two damage. Wait, no more. Yeah, so we should have four. Um, then I will take initiative. I'm hit you for three more. Ooh, that rancor is big. is really big. That's what she said. I'm going to flip out the Grand Inquisitor. How many cards in your hand? Two. I just got to kill him, don't I? Yeah. Oh, I think I misplayed that. I should have played Boba first. And made you take care of Boba. Uh, all right. Boba. Three to base. Mm -hmm. Um. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I've got a McClunky to. Yeah, kill that one. Him, right? Mm -hmm. uh, three to base. Four. Why? Oh, yeah, hero. I'm thinking rebel. That's why. Oh, you're good. Uh, so that puts me on 27. I don't know that I have a way to deal with that. Yep, GG. On the last turn, I should have played Boba first and stood him up with Grand Inquisitor so that you have to deal with that. Mm -hmm. And then roll out Grand Inquisitor. Did you have a way to deal with both of them? Uh, I had bombing run. And that would have mm -hmm. done... That wouldn't have... It wouldn't have. It w could have killed Boba after he yeah. readied. Well, I definitely wouldn't have attacked with the Rancor to make you bring out the Inquisitor, right? Right. I mean, that's, I wouldn't have done that. I would have. I just would have probably shaded it up. A t if you would have read, playing him, mm -hmm. makes you not ready him. And ready him. I, I would have just. I would. I would have attacked you over here. And then yeah, did all that. Yeah. I think I had. I think I was still okay. That one was a little better. Um, yes, him getting to put out, but it was... That Rancor I, did work. Yeah, I, I think it was my masterful play that allowed me to squeak that one out. 
from the garbage that was in my hands. Speaking of what, which, Jason, did you see my comment? And this, Justin, that is about Jason. So next time Jason makes a tier list, which it was great by the way, he was good. Yeah, yeah, his, yeah it's good. His, uh, but he can't put garbage on the bottom if we call ourselves the garbage rollers. Yeah, garbage can. has to be the S tier. He did put the good eaters on the bottom. <laughs> oh, he did. <laughs> no, I mean he's got to put. It's got to be garbage tiers the top, and uh, you can blank this out. The shit tiers on the bottom, right? Mm. That's what you got to do, right? <laughs> It's like people don't cuss. Um, all right, well, let's see. Uh, I'm going to keep this. Let me show them what I got. Go okay. All right, so we've got duplicate uniques there, so we'll resource that. Uh, those are pretty dang good, so I think we need to keep. Um, we'll find something to play at that price point later. <clears throat> all you? Let's see, should I keep this? I could <coughs> go there. There. So last turn, uh, last game, I was I kept I kept uh, guild target with the do two damage to a base or a unit and mm -hmm. you played that effort right there with a shield and everything. <laughs> I was like, what the heck? I can't get that guy off. So, <clears throat> I mean, the chances of you being able to do, of me playing just a two health unit round one is on the low side, too. I mean, you got Greedo. Take this. Yeah, Greedo in there. So. That's kind of funny. Hmm. I'm gonna do go to your base. Him being a stinking three three with a shield. It's pretty dang good. Oh yeah. His ability becomes more and more of a liability the longer into the game you go, so Oh yeah, I know. If you don't have a way to get rid of him early, he can become a real real liability. I think he's going to be. I mean, if you if you're playing Han, you got to expect K two coming down on the second turn, which is really good. Which is crazy good. Uh, Boba. Hmm. Let's do three to your base. Base. Do something a little different here. I'll use GI, stand up bubble. Yeah, I had a feeling you'd do that. So, yeah, I could do that, but I don't, I don't know if I want to waste them on that. I mean, otherwise, you just lose Bo Katan for nothing. Yeah, but I got tricks, bro. I got tricks. <laughs> sure, all right, let's do that. Let's do it. Let's keep, let's keep, let's keep me here and let's see if I can pull it off. All right, so now your turn. Initiative. That's what That's what I wanted. <coughs> yeah. One, two, four. Um, so, so like it, it also. I don't know. You're not going to do it anyways. I know you're you're a better player than that. But you can put Greedo down if you want to. I'd love you to put Greedo down, but you're not going to Greedo down. Yeah, with K two. Well, no, with K two out, you're not going to do that. But I mean, Amazon's just going to kill K two right now. Take three. Kill him. All right. Ready those back up. Mm-hmm. What else um, you want? I guess I could draw a card. That's that's the only other good option. Yeah? That's the only thing I could do. Yeah. All right. Dropping powerhouse Toro Calican. Let's put that on. <laughs> um, play Dengar. And do a damage to Dengar to ready, my man.
Oh, because of him. He's the one that did that. Yeah. I was reading dinner like, what happened here? Uh, when you play another bounty hunter, if you do raid this unit, yes. Yeah, okay. Um, let's see. Let's get physical. Um, it's kind of curious, but I guess you were struggling for cards to put in here. Um, let's go ahead and do three more to your base. Mm -hmm. Can I do three to your base? Oh, he's back. Ouch. Use Grand Inquisitor. Stun Toro up. I'm going to claim. Okay, I'll do three more to your base. <clears throat> so if you've been watching and you're still watching, Tyler said go to space. I really listen to that, don't I? Yeah. Well, I mean, if it's working on the ground, go to the, you know, do your thing. Two. Taking six to my base. You take how many cards in your hand? Three. Three? Mm -hmm. Um Yeah, I take three more to your base. You took the three? Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh so then swap here. Take three more to your base. Play Amazon again. The GI. Stand him up. No hit your base for three. Wait, that's. It just, it should just be ten, right? I was at, I was at nine. Oh, you were at nine? Ten okay. number twelve, right? Get to ready all my stuff. Yeah, it's all ready. And yeah, he takes three. Yeah. I'm going to say four. Uh, it's been at 22. Uh, Stand-up Django with Grand Inquisitor. Kill Django. Ooh. Carabast. Carabast is a thing now. Mm -hmm. Bring out the GI. Four to him. Uh, hit your base for six. Three to base. 25. Initiative. Three more to base. Did you get it? Mm hmm? Did you get anything? Uh, I'm going to be one short. Hmm. Yeah. I get you to 24. Good job. Um, it, it's, I think it's really, this is really hit or miss. This is definitely a, a good thing to work in. Progress. I thought they had another ship. Do you have that in here? That no. like the the Ruku fighter, whatever it is. I, you know what I'm talking about? Ruku it's, fighter. Yeah, it's is like it one, it's a two it, one when, when it, it dies. dies you get to draw a card. You draw a card. I think it is. No, you no, do a, a damage. Do a damage. Yeah, something? something like that. Yeah, the mercenary gunship I think is more value. Well, I mean, yeah, it's a better card. It, it's but it's quicker. 
And I, yeah, I don't, that's why I think they both cost two. I, th I think I thought the other one cost one. No. Is it two? two. It's only two. Yeah. I don't know. I All think right, it's, well, not, it's not bad. Yeah, it's a good game. I think masterfully piloted. Yeah, of course. It had nothing to do with my deck building. 